Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of The Further Adventures of Indiana Jones from Marvel Comics. This is issue number 14. And look at this, it's a, this cover is a painting. It's an actual painting this time. Isn't that crazy? Totally different from the other ones. Creepy as heck though, look at that. His hat's flying off. I don't know what the heck's going on. We got a new artist. That last one, I'm sorry to say, I was not... I, I hate putting down people, I don't mean to. But I just did not like his artwork for Indiana Jones. Today, in this issue, we have David... I'm going to butcher his name, here I go. David Mazzuccelli? Mazzuccelli? I don't know. Apparently, the saint did the inks. I don't even know. Uh, Simon Templar? Roger Moore himself? Did the inks? I don't know what that means. But anyway, this came out February of 1984. So, we got that page. Let's, let's move right along here. I'm trying to hold them down again. One million dollar Christmas rebate spectacular. Wow. I don't know if you're doing what I'm doing. I'm checking out the artwork here. Looks pretty good so far. Not much is happening. They're just people talking. So not really trying to... Am I in front? Not even close. Look at me. Oh my goodness. I'm trying to... See? That's what I was talking about before. The hat is a little bit better. It's uh, folded correctly. I call it folded. Your work's not bad. Story's good, though. My hand in the way? Probably. Yeah, it's not bad. I'm enjoying it here. A lot of action happening. Now it's raining. Oh, he get, uses his whip, but the branch broke. Can you see that? Am I in frame? Yeah. I think I said this last Indiana Jones episode. I love when he used the whip. Hold these pages down. There we go. Maybe like that. There we go. A little bit better. Yeah, the artwork's not bad. Still no... Man, that carry came out. We were spoiled, weren't we? I would never really talk about him growing up. I, I was always a Neil Adams or John Buscema. Uh, there's a whole bunch more, but my brain's broken. I can't think of any more. But, you know, those type of guys. And, yeah, he's right up there, in my opinion. Excellent. Ooh, we knocked the gun out of his hand. Out of her hand. Nice. That actually kind of looks like Harrison Ford for, just, you know, for the first time. Just barely. Ooh, James Bond again. I was just talking about James Bond. Are you good enough to be the world's most famous secret agent? Oh, I mean, as a kid, that's who I wanted to be. Well, I liked Indiana Jones a lot, but I have I've had to pick one that was even bigger than Indiana Jones for me. It was James Bond. Who didn't want to be a James Bond? I mean, there's that glare again. I'm trying so hard to... It's not straight. Okay, sorry, I lingered on that one a little long because I was I was actually looking at all the action. I, this, this look that was a good. Those are good panels. I like those. To be continued. All right, there's Dungeons and Dragons. Doctor Strange looks like yep. 
What's this? Super Cobra? Is that what it's called? I don't know that. Oh my. Yep, Super Cobra. Alright, back to the front with the painting. Wasn't that weird that they used a painting? I thought it was. But, uh... Ah, here we go. I'm sorry about that. There we go. All right, that was issue number 14 of The Further Adventures of Indiana Jones. Uh, issue 15 coming very soon, I think. I'm make, I'm trying to make time for it. Uh, tell me what you think in the comments. Is Carrie, you, you, are you a huge Carrie Gamel fan like I am? Did you, did you think this artist did okay? I don't know. It's up to you. I'll, uh, we'll see who does that art next, next issue. I can't wait to see. So... Check back with me again. Do me a favor. Have a great day. I'll do the same. And uh, yeah. See you next time, everybody. Have a great day. Bye-bye.